What's up YouTube? This is Cooking with Doug and today I'll be going over my Keurig Freedom Clever clip. Now, of course this is not made by Keurig but um, it's a third party but uh, this will allow you to um, brew your own coffee no matter what cup you put in. Period. This says it works with all 2.0 brewers. I have a K350. Let's turn it around and see what it looks like. It's very simple. I just noticed something guys you see that color I just bought this today uh, the Tootsie Roll hot cocoa and I'm gonna do a review after this on this this is this is the best hot cocoa anyway it looks like the colors was tricking the machine more than anything I, I just realized that anywho we're gonna be using this K cup self brewer as our example to see if it works and here's how I'm going to use it as an example because look what happens when I put this in my machine right now. Alright, so this is my K350 guys, as you may already know from my past videos. And if you don't, you need to watch some of them. <laughs> but anyway, <clears throat> when I put this particular K cup in, the self brewer, it's basically giving me the hot water, you know, option. Right, so if I hit continue, then I could do six, and it's all it's four four ounces and six ounces. So that's all I can do with this particular self brewer K cups. I know other ones can do more. I'm talking about this one, and this is perfect for this test. So if this little thing works, then I should be able to do eight, ten, ten ounces, whatever. You get my drift. Okay, let's take this back out, and let's begin to install let's look at the directions check it out guys read it for yourself all right and i think once that color blocks that i think we're good to go so let's see. I just snapped it in, guys. If I can get a better look at it. Yeah, there we go. I just snapped it in. So we're about to test it out. <laughs> this works even sweeter. I just closed it and it's already working. I didn't I don't even have to put this in. So there's nothing in there, right? Now look what it says. It's completely awesome. Look at that. Look at all my options. Six. So, okay, eight. Four. Okay, I just wanted to make sure it went down to four. So, from four to ten, I could do strong. Blah, blah, blah. That's awesome. So, I didn't even have to put the cup in. Obviously, it works. But, just for the... Just for... For video's sake, I'm still going to brew something anyway, just to make sure, just so you know. What should I choose? What should I choose? Well, okay, guys, I'm, I'm going to do Dunkin' Donuts, and I know Starbucks is better, but I'm from New York, and we like Dunkin' Donuts. So, don't shoot me. All right, look, guys, a happy medium. I have a Chick-fil-A mug. See? So don't shoot me. All right. So you saw my Dunkin' Donuts in here. We're going to put it in here. Wait. Will it close with it? There it goes. It's a little stiff, but it's all right. I'm going to go with strong. I've never brewed my own coffee strong before so let's try that cool that's even more awesome guys and guys make sure you check out my um hot cocoa review man that i mean that's the best i thought starbucks was had the best hot cocoa um for the keurig but nope <clears throat> that tootsie roll is what's up also what i was gonna say hmm, hmm, hmm. i'm rambling i know i know i know but um what else I was going to say? 
Oh yeah, so with this piece, so some of you Keurig users that came from an older Keurig, now you can use your self-brew Keurig cup that would normally wouldn't work for 2.0s. It will work for 2.0s now. So, hmm. Yep. That works. Oh, there you have it, guys. That is my review of the Freedom Clip um, for your uh, Keurig 2.0 machines. And remember, it can work with anyone. You like if you like it, comment if you have any questions or if you just want to say hello. <laughs> but if anything, thanks for just looking at my video. Um, and it's Cooking with Doug, and I'm going.